So I came across this a couple of days ago. Um, so I was at school and I have my this is my Nexus 7 tablet. Um, well, this is a screenshot from it. I'm currently on my computer, but um, this is from my Nexus 7 tablet. I was at school and I can't do skip on the tablet, so I was just browsing Reddit uh, or Google really, and I found this. And this is interesting because. Apparently, Mod Reach had posted earlier, and then whatever he came back to respond, and so someone's like, "Did you guys ban Jepin for botting yet?" So someone's like that, and I'm like, "Okay, whatever." And I was surprised to see this, but okay, he's saying he's Mod Reach, and he's responding to this guy four nine six one four six zero two. Well, actually, it's not that, but I I clicked it, and it 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 was that. I don't know. Oh yeah, three three five. That that number. Okay, yeah. Um, I don't I don't usually use Reddit, so I'm not used to knowing where to look. But yeah, um, I actually have checked his every now and then, um, in front of me, and have never really found anything. And then this is where he goes. He doesn't know how to type. I mean, he screwed up probably something. I don't know. I haven't really found anything in the terms of botting or something. I would just. In terms of botting, yeah, in terms of botting is what I assume what he was trying to say, but anything botting of the term. So he uh, he has, however, set off bot watch every now and then, and then he's got to go blah blah blah. So what this kind of tells me is that it just tells me a few things. It says it confirms what I already was believing that um, bot watch is sending off false positives. But what this also says is that. One Jagex knows it's sending off false positives because they're saying, "Okay, um, it ha I've set off bot watch," but then he doesn't actually believe in botting, and so since he he hasn't found anything um, that makes him think that I'm botting, um, and yet the software saying it's, it's given a red flag. Hey, look at Jebum, something's wrong here. Um, no, I I know I don't bot, so this is just further proof. Basically, there's a lot of people that have been getting falsely banned, and then there's JMods going and saying, Oh, no, our systems are perfect. If it says he's a bot, he's a bot, and that's it. And so, like, you got Elvis 99 who got banned, which I which I fully believe he's legit. Uh, you've got uh, E-Fire got banned. Charles got banned. Green Wave got banned. Uh, all these legit people are getting banned. Uh, God vs. Devil in the main game, he got banned, and a thousand times. <laughs> um, so, like, they they know that it's not working. At least some GM mods know it doesn't work, and some do, I guess. I don't know. Or some think it works. I don't know. But, here we go. Uh, bot watch. And, I don't know. I, I find this very interesting. Um, so, it's just, I, I think, like, they, they look at a list of everybody that uh, potentially botted. Uh, any, any, like, so their program, BotWatch, comes up with a list of potential bots, and then they have a human look at them. And then if they see anything that looks potentially human, then they're like, okay, they're, they're, then, okay, they're not human, we don't ban them. But then if they don't, if they can't find anything that's definitively human, they'll, um, so like somebody's being really efficient and they're not talking and they're just not wasting any ticks either, then they're just going to assume they're a bot and ban them. At least th that's what I think the procedure is. I, I can't know for sure. Um, so that's that. And then another thing related to rules and banning and stuff is a lot of people, there's this whole thing that's been going on for a while, probably past few months. Uh, uh, this thingy, uh, I don't know what the original post was, some on the Runescape phones, but this is this will do. So this is from Mod Infinity. And so Mod Infinity and Mod Balance are brand new J mods from early last year. They are the people that, they run Rune Zone. They're not the people that make the rules, they don't enforce the rules, they're just community J mods. And they made a few comments last year uh, about auto hockeys and mouse keys and they were totally ignorant and had no idea what had no idea what they were talking about and looking at this maybe they learn a little bit more, but they still don't know what they're talking about. Uh, so basically this repeating the same thing uh, if you want a few of you weren't satisfied with our response to the situation so we escalated the issue to our anti cheating specialists who have confirmed that our statements are were correct blah 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 um what then the thing is they're not being very they don't know they think auto hockey says something that it doesn't or they think mouse keys do something and then they don't do this extra thing that they actually do 
Um, they've never actually used mouse keys in on scan. They're only like 1k total. Uh, that, uh, not even or something, I don't know. And so they don't know anything about scaling. Um, they've never done anything themselves. They think people use mouse keys. Um, so they think, okay, you got, here's, here's, this is, this is real mouse keys. This is not auto hotkeys. This is Windows mouse keys. They think players are hitting the two key. Uh, wait, is it on? Oh yeah, there goes. It's just really, really slow. So they think people, players are hitting the the two key, and they're going little slowly down here, and then and then they're hitting the five key to left click, and then two key, la 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 la, and they think they're just holding it down to to do that, and that they, that's what they think. I don't know. They don't understand that people are holding down control or using sticky keys to have control held down. And so, like, if you come over here to RuneScape, which I am just FKing over here, so you come over here. This is a uh, so you hold down control, you hit two. Um, watch I set the setting. Okay, maybe the sign's on, right? But yeah, you down, you hit two, and then you hit five, and you drop. And I'll pick that back up. But yeah, that that is mouse keys. And then this. Uh, so I'll open up this. So this is just auto hockey. This is an auto hockey script, and all it's basically doing it's just mouse keys. It's the exact same thing as mouse keys. Um, just saying a bit more control over instead of having a little tile so you got this this is how you set up mouse keys you have this stupid thing you have a little tiny bar and you just gotta kinda guess that and you mix it around with the uh... what is it the the point of speed you mix it around with the other point of speed um, setting in the mouse settings and you do a combination of these two things um... to get a rough idea of what it might do and then all all this script is is specif specifying it in an, in an easier way to get exactly what you want. That's that's all it's doing. It's not um, make one. It's not automatic. It's fully manual. You you could cheat. There there is a way to make an, um, something of an auto clicker out of this. So you have to be extremely careful. But if you use it within certain guidelines, certain not even guidelines, certain rules. If you if anything is one to one ratio, it's okay. Um, that's that's basically. I was there when um, Zafa and the Jane mod. I think it was like Mod Jonathan. He they were discussing. They basically created the rules. Mod Jonathan created the whole one to one ratio rule. I was on the forums. I was there the whole time. He basically said, any form of input you can use any form of input. You you can use your fingers on a touch screen. You can use uh, a remote control. Uh, not you can. I suppose remote control. I was gonna think that uh, controller, game controller, console controller. You can use a joystick. You can use anything. All it has to do is that one input in some one in real life action has to result in one in game uh, action, such as a click or a movement, and it can't be a combination of both. So all this says in detail. This is move mouse. Um, zero pixels horizontally which means nowhere 40 pixels down so um, I have this running so 40 pixels down is a drop so I, I left well, let me get out that I left click this drop that it just goes straight to drop it's so this this right here this is uh I could lower the point of speed to get it perfect on uh, the mouse keys but this is auto hockeys and this right here uh, I sh probably should have had on a better set of beer. This is the same thing, but in mouse keys. Right there. There you go. Mouse keys. Auto hotkeys. Mouse keys. So it, it, it's the same functionality. Um, and the JMods don't seem to understand this because they have no idea how people use it. And yeah, so it's just really retarded. And then the one stands for, uh, I believe this one is one millisecond. So it, it's not really important. It's just it goes down one millisecond after uh, you hit the key and then R stands for relative relative to the current position and then return just it, it, it's basically a period it's the end of the entire statement you're doing in fact I could actually just I technically could just do that and that and the whole thing would actually still work um, I just like the structure oops I won't actually redo that oh well uh, and click this is simply left click so this is uh, this is my left click and then this is the mouse keys left click 
exact same functionality. Um, the key weight is to the three is just to identify which key, but um, the key weight is it's basically uh, if you hold down the three normally on auto hotkeys without the key weight, it'll actually spam it after if you hold it down a lot longer than like a second or something or two seconds, it'll actually spam it, and so the key weight is to remove that potential spam. So that that's actually just all of this. This entire script is just to. Uh, I, I call this construction.hk, it's really just, it's my main one, it's, I just originally first made it for construction, but this is my main one. Um, but yeah, this is all I use, it's, it's just the same thing as mouse keys. It's, I hit this key and it goes down this distance, I want to go down this little distance, this little distance. This is, it's really just mouse keys, it's not super mouse keys, it's just mouse keys with easier customization. You can do the ex exact same kind of stuff in mouse keys. Um, on Windows, uh, but these J mods. So like, I I can finish reading this if you guys didn't read this. But these J mods don't understand that they. Uh, he's like software that gener. Uh, wait, let's see. Uh, let me just say. When it comes to scaling, mouse keys can potentially give an advantage when it comes to empty, emptying the inventory quickly. So it seemed so it seemed like he knew what he was talking about then, but then he's like, however, this requires a certain level of skill. Though the following section of making rule is quite clear with regards to this behavior. So if that generates input to a uh, game app applets, this is the software that automatically moves the mouse pointer or generates mouse clicks or key presses. Now mouse keys do not generate input as that is done by the user. Just like I'm using auto hotkeys here, done exactly the same way. It's manually done. It's one-to-one -one ratio. There's nothing automatic. It follows the exact same uh, kind of feature that mouse keys are doing. Um, auto hotkey, auto hotkeys are. And it, this says it doesn't automatically move the mouse pointer to a specified coordinate. Correct. That's exactly how uh, people who use auto hotkeys use it. Those who aren't cheating with it. Um, it moves at a steady pace in the direction specified by the key press. See that's that's not true. He's he's not thinking about control, so he does, he doesn't seem to understand that one. And then it's, it stops doing so when the key is pressed. Okay. Well, if you want to view it even with control, if you do this with uh, mouse um, auto hotkeys. So I want to do this. I hold it down. So if I hold it down, this is what happens. It, it just goes down if I'm holding down that. And then if I do it with mouse keys, Windows mouse keys, this is the reaction I get. Exact same thing. It's the exact same thing. In fact, it even looks like uh, it even looks like this is mouse keys. This actually looks like it's going uh, even bigger jerk than uh, all the hotkeys here. Frankly, <laughs> um, well, hotkeys actually looks a lot smoother when it does that, huh? And then let's see. It stops doing so when the key is released. Yep. It doesn't generate mouse clicks as that is done by the user pressing five, or I can, so I can hit five, or I can hit uh, so like I can hit five on here. Whoops. Okay, there we go. I can hit five on here, or I can hit my three on the other side. Exact same thing. If I hold it down, nothing happens there. If I hold this one down, nothing happens there. All right, and then uh... let's see without augmentation or modification uh... and then a he's like in parentheses adjusting the inbuilt settings is not augmentation or modification and it's fine so auto hockey is just doing the script adjusting the script is the same thing um... it's just changing the settings so you're just changing the settings with words without instead of a bar you're just doing a bit more fine detail um... but that's no different from this exact concept so uh, mouse keys are not capable of violating the rules against their part software. Now this is this is true. Okay, auto hotkeys are capable of violating the rules. So not all auto, auto hockey H AHK use is legitimate. Um, so if you were to combine, which is this is very possible, you could combine. You wanted to uh, copy this and paste that in here, and then you so. I'm not going to use this, but if I wanted to do this, um, whoops, R and then delete that, and then I wanted to do like cop control this, and then like that kind of shit, this would be against rules because this is this would basically drop two things at once immediately, one after another. This would be against rules. 
Um, so you would never use a script like that. And you know, go. So that would be against those. That's the way to cheat. Don't save. And so there is some kind of trust in that. So they can never actually say auto hotkeys is allowed per se. It's just. But you can't. You, you can't necessarily say it's all banned altogether either. It's just you use certain features. If you try to do something that's not one to one ratio, it's it's against rules. It's, that's that period, whatever. And so it's just this JMod doesn't seem to understand. It's Mod Matt. Mod Matt K actually came out and said essentially what I'm saying right now. He said that they can't say it's. I I, I gotta go find the post maybe again. But he basically said you can't say necessarily that it isn't. Um, that it is or it isn't against the rules. It's just because he he, he thinks a lot of people would misconstrue it to say, oh, all the hockey's okay, so that that means I can do this, this, and this. And he doesn't want people to get confused about what is and what isn't allowed. So they're not saying one way or another. Um, at least that was his explanation. But different J mods say different things. Um, there's not always uh, the same communication. So let's go further down this thing. Uh, let's see. This has always been our stance, and see, this is always, this is another thing. So a lot of people um seem to be thinking that the rules have suddenly changed sometime within the past year. Nothing's changed. It's the rules as it is here are the exact same rules as it's been. Uh, when was this determined? Four years ago. So when when the whole Zafa thing uh it was not five years ago actually it was probably five years ago now, I don't know, but yeah, uh, four and a half, and so all this, it's, the rules have been the same, so he's saying nothing's changed, this is not the first time he said it, and he said this probably two other times, um, so nothing's changed, this is the exact same thing, so it, it's always been allowed to do anything that's one-on-one -on -one ratio, this fits the entire description of actually what he's really trying to say, he just does not seem to understand what people actually use mouse keys for, or what people use auto hotkeys for, and yeah, and I did, I, I actually, I, pre, I, I frankly just call auto hotkeys mouse keys because the exact same fucking thing, um, as I use them, it's just mouse keys, so there's Windows mouse keys and then there's auto hotkey mouse keys, uh, HK mouse keys, but they're all mouse keys. Uh, mouse keys you can define as moving your mouse with the with keys on the keyboard. That's mouse keys. Um, so anyway, uh, that's my view of it. I I have noticed a lot. Holy shit, I've noticed a lot. Every like on Reddit or whatever, just any time people start talking about um, all the hotkeys, uh, like when Jagger says stuff like this, uh, particularly these J mods, uh, when they say stuff. Um, Immediately, the o always the same example is me. Everybody brings up me. They're like, oh, "Why isn't Jevron banned for this already?" <laughs> it's just like, "Oh, I'm just like, um, I don't. Know. I'm just, I'm, like, <laughs> I don't. I'm, I'm, I'm just thinking. Are you trying to get me banned? I, I don't think I should be banned. I don't think this is against the rules. I don't think it's any advantage, anything extra over what you can get with mouse keys." Other than that, it's a bit more convenient on your hands. You don't have to hold down control. You don't have to use sticky keys and you're able to talk. But those are not specific to any feature that affects RuneScape directly. Um, they're more specific to Windows. Uh, Microsoft designed the mouse keys in a poor manner. They designed the interface to create them in a poor manner. And so you just I'm just using auto hotkeys as an improvement of the interface in order to use it. It's the exact same functionality. And so I hope uh, that kind of resolves my stance on this. I haven't really talked about it. Um, but yeah. Uh, actually, I first only got into it. Uh, Jagex, because I don't need it for agility. Um, even though I technically do keep it on. Um, I, like I, I right now like I use it. I hit the three key to log in, stuff like that. Or like if I'm typing, since I already have the mouse hovering over where I'm gonna click next, um, I just I can type and then qu quickly hit the three key as I'm typing and then keep on typing instead of having to move back to my mouse. And it's just something like that. Uh, I could also do something similar on a laptop where I just hit my thumb on the uh, touchpad and that's a convenient way to keep on typing while clicking that one last thing. Um, but yeah, it's just little things like that. I use a login for like whatever. I hit the three key. I uh, don't really use 
the actual moving up and down or anything um, anymore because I'm back to agility. But yeah, I first started using, I first came across um, auto hockey's when uh, some someone who does dungeon and my kind of stuff. Uh, he he mentioned it when uh, we were doing the Jaggers Cup. Um, someone we were competing when I was competing in the Jaggers Cup and I was doing like thieving. That was really useful for thieving, um, monkey knife fighters and whatever. Um, so I don't know. Uh, I, that's when I first came, heard of it, and then 07 comes out, and I decided to start doing rune crafting uh, after doing agility. And okay, well, I'm gonna I'm gonna use it was either use mouse keys again, um, or I just use auto hotkeys again. And I was just like, because I had done my old rune crafting with uh, mouse keys. Windows mouse keys, and so I don't know. I just, I just went with auto hotkeys, and I found it really nice, uh, convenient, um, and I just kept on going with that. And I think it just kind of picked up. I don't know if I was the one who kind of popularized it. I, I a lot of people like to mention me, but um, I don't know. Just I just noticed it kind of picked up uh, in the past year. I haven't really heard of much of it before that. Um, but yeah. So 22 minutes. Uh, 21 minutes actually, but yeah. Uh, I don't know, you guys want to watch? Here's, here's my agility. Agility, yep. Agility. Okay. Uh, well, there you go. Um, I don't know. Is there anything interesting? Anything interesting whatsoever to show? Uh, friends online. Whoops. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is my outfit. Okay, yeah, so here's all my outfit shit. So I, I kind of like this is an. In oh, yeah, here's Big Red Japan here still. LOL. And apparently, apparently, good news. I did hear. I don't know if he was trolling me or not, but I think he's gonna actually be fixing this mod John C. I don't know if he was quite trolling me or not, but he. I think he might actually be changing that uh, AFK bit. So I'm. I'm hoping he wasn't trolling. Um, but yeah, uh, friends online. Friends online. Let's see anyone interesting. Okay, so 200 mobility. Uh, Matthews, maker of Orion, uh, Jake, number two, blah, 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 blah. This is that friend I was mentioning earlier. Um, and INTJ. Oh, God. Oh, God. I accidentally hit something. Oh, God. Oh, God. Here we go. Who's this? I See, I would. Oh, yeah. That's one feature I want them to fix. Have it show previous name. Sheesh. Okay, whatever. Uh, nobody interesting. Okay. I don't know. I was just trying to see if there's anything entertaining. Oh, yeah. Rain. Hi, Rain. Hello, Rain and Harmony. Yeah, Harmony set a really good record. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, here we go. Where is it? Where is it? Um, records, records, records. Here we go. Uh, let me move this over. It's all white. Come on, load. You can load. Why aren't you loading? Come on. My internet is having this slow. I wonder if that has anything to do with uh my date all because I changed my date. Okay, it's not loading. All right. Well, anyways, I can uh, say it. Uh, well, it's current, but yeah, you can kind of see that 8.5. This is not current, actually. I have to update it. But uh, basically, Hom Hom got an 8.9 mil record, and Layla Door has an 8.4. I think it was yeah, 8.4 mil week record, and that's that's really good. Uh, 8.9 mil. Uh, both of them are a little bit over 20 hours sleep, so they're really good at, I guess, balancing um, real life better than me, in my opinion. Balancing like fewer hours um, spent in real life when doing the no life and records than when I do it. So like I notice when I do it, I guess like I, I just between showering, eating, shitting, uh, whatever, it just seems I waste more time in real life, and so I have to end up sleeping less in order to get a similar record. I don't know. It's just what it seems like. Um, so maybe that's something I can improve on. But yeah, so while the records are 8.9 mil a week at this course would be, yeah, <laughs> that's around around my 10 mil Bob week record, um, if not higher. And it's just like, yeah, she did 10 hours more sleep than I did in that record. And it's just like, huh? <laughs> so I, I, I think I really need to improve on... Uh, not wasting that real lifetime when I'm doing that. I don't. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but yeah, I know it's just. But sleep deprivation. Oh my god, yeah, that's very, very hard. So I think both Layla Door and Harm Harmony are gonna try to beat that. 
like the best records like by the set by like half a dozen people in a week is uh, 12 hours sleep and uh, so that's 156 hour week and somebody's got to hit 160 and these uh, these two seem to be really competing towards uh, going for that high record there and I'm, I'm hopeful that someone in Hexus will eventually actually hit it. Uh, Elvis 99 might have but then he got banned and no chance of that happening again. Um, I don't, he's not going to come back. I don't see that happening. Um, but yeah. He's legit. I, he's been, I, some, a lot of people have been asking me this. I haven't answered. Uh, but yeah, he's... People ask him what, what I think about Elvis 99 getting banned. He's skilled at 703. He's legit. Um, I've been f good friends with him for five years. We've been talking on IRC, Facebook, etc. Um, after he's gone banned and stuff. He's put effort in trying to get unbanned. It's just... Uh, nobody will talk to him anymore. <laughs> Basically, that's just like okay. It's they think they think he bought it, and that said, they're not gonna talk to him anymore. They don't care. Um, so I don't know. I I I frankly I frankly don't believe he bought it. Uh, I I would believe he will trade traded. Sure, I I could believe that if you, if you were to tell me he did that. Sure, but I I don't I don't believe he he bought it. So that's my take on it. He he certainly didn't bought his hunter. <laughs> Uh, I don't, if anyone wants to try to suggest that, that that's crazy talk. They can suggest that <laughs> he's he's pretty much the number one guy in Hunter, uh, in and all of Roots here because he's gotten uh, he he was like the third person, I think third or fourth person to get 200 more Hunter at Chins in the original game. Uh, I met him before he got that, so no. Um. Anyway, he was he, he hadn't done Hunter in a long time long time before when he ended up getting banned but yeah anyway uh i've made like very low progress <laughs> since my last video i mean i got school i had school uh thursday so i'm out till tuesday normally monday but then if we have a holiday uh some holiday who, somebody i guess martin luther king day i think it is i don't know i think so but yeah okay video's over okay yep stop